Hello gang, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Derail Valley. Uh, I'm riding on the, the roof of my shunter at the moment. Uh, we're out near the coal mine. Um, I'm not entirely sure why we're out near the coal mine. The game has elected to, uh, to start me here, uh, despite the fact that I was somewhere else uh, previously. Uh, anyway, um, let's do a quick recap of where we're at. I'll, I'll show you where the coal mine is. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Um, you might look around there and you kind of go, look to the very top right of your screen there. You'll see the little kind of uh, cyan arrow that's doing a little bit of a dance at the moment. That's me. Um, actually, which way is it going to take? Oh, whatever. It doesn't really make any difference, does it? Uh, or does it? Which is the quick way? The quick way is to go uh, uh, is to go left here. Let's go that way. It's that way. Okay. Well, let's, let's just make sure that's working. Um, I've done a couple of missions since you were last here. Uh, some more successful than the others, but uh, ain't that always the way? Uh, no, no, we're good. We can only go left. All right, fine. Um, and uh, and I've made a little bit of money. Uh, there we go. I've got thirteen thousand two hundred fifty-nine bucks in my wallet. Uh, I carry it around with me everywhere, just in case an essential purchase uh, rears its uh, rears its head. It's quite scenic up here, isn't it? It's even more so when you're stood on the roof of your train. Um, but I am Denzel Washington. Uh, and therefore, uh, I'm perfectly entitled to stand on the top of my train uh, when the mood takes me. Anyway, I'll get to somewhere interesting, and then we'll pick up the action. Okay, not so much on uh, picking up the action there. Uh, we're now riding the train down in the ravine. Uh, my my moments of, uh, of being Denzel uh, have, uh, have departed me. A slightly overconfident way to start the show there. Mm. Where, where's well if the oh no train's broken sticks? Um, yeah, that's. Uh, I'll tell you what though, we we should possibly turn it off. Uh, just you know for the environment. Derailed. You don't say. There we go. Let's get out of that. Uh, smashing. So here we are, arriving now at the food factory and town. I'm literally coasting right now, but it's all been downhill. Uh, all the way here, and uh, and so I've, I've ridden it downhill. Now, I've taken a couple of missions from here previously. Uh, they do vary in terms of complexity, uh, or in terms of the likelihood that I spend hours upon hours trying to get it done uh, before failing spectacularly. Uh, but uh, but we're gonna we're gonna pull it in about here. Uh, there you go. That'll do. Thank you. Jolly good, and uh, and I'm also starting to get in the habit of turning the engine off uh, purely because uh, it uses fuel uh, while you're uh, just leaving it idling there. Um, so uh, so yeah, we want to keep the fuel intact. I have run out of fuel on a, a previous mission attempt. Uh, for those of you who follow me on Twitter, uh, you will know all about that attempt. Uh, for it was high on drama and low on actually being caught on camera, which is a real shame because it was very spectacular indeed. Um, anyway, first mission is uh, find the ruddy office. Uh, well, I tell you what, the process of elimination suggests we go this way first, and then we can uh, then we can roll it back again and uh, and see exactly where it isn't uh, or some such. Uh, right? Okay. Of course, you'd think my having been here before would suggest that uh, that I knew where the thing was. Uh, but no, no, I've got, I've got apps. I've got a foggiest. Uh, it's it's not that distinct a building, other than it's white. Um, and uh, and when you've seen one station, you have seen quite a lot of them. Uh, they do uh, they do follow a very similar aesthetic. Uh, so uh, I don't know what's uh, what's up this way. No, that's that's a tower block. That's not the whole. Here we go. Here we go. This is it. This is the fella. Uh, it's got this fire escape on the back that doesn't go anywhere. Uh, so, uh, so here's our uh, station office. Okay, right. What have we got on the uh, What have we got on the cards here? Literally. Now I need seven grand in order to be able to afford the steam loco. Uh, what have we got here? That's shunting. No. Uh, that one is shunting. No shunting. Get off. In fact, this uh, this drop it on the floor method is proving to be quite effective. Uh, Twelve grand. City Southwest. Hang on, let's have a look. City Southwest. How far's that? Uh, 
it's actually not that bad a route the only downside is there's no office there so i can't hand it straight in upon arrival what i want is to uh, is to get to i don't know what did i saw sawmill there where's the sawmill 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 no no rejected uh city southwest no get out of the way yeah, yeah, don't look at it. We're not that interested. Uh, okay, all right, tell you what, we'll take this one uh, because I know that the goods factory in town also has a drop-off. Now, this won't get me to where I need to be um, in terms of money, uh, but what it will do is uh, it's, a, it's a nice route, this one. I've driven it before. Uh, and, uh, right, we want 41 through 43 of the flat cars. Okie dokie. Uh, there's 46... 41 through 43. You could look up the platform number. You didn't do this last time either. Uh, track 7. Yeah, okay. So uh, what do we got here? That's 8. So that's this next one over. All right. 41 through 43. That's 31. So that's not it. Uh, but I was pretty much there already. I was, I, was about, I was literally about to discover it. No, yo, you can take my word for it. That was definitely going to happen. 41 through 43. Hopefully it's the end ones here. There's 41. There's 42. There's 43. And there's a bonus couple attached to the other end. Okie dokie. No problem. Me and uh, me and Chuggaboom here, we can we can take care of that. Uh, right. Okay, now then. Have I got enough reversing space? Yes and no. Well, which is it? Well, it's it's yes in that there is room. All right, let's fire it up anyway. Yeah, give it some of that. Wang some of this on. Job done. Break off. Bang it in gear. It is in gear because you left it in gear because you're a total professional. Ah, details. All right, what I'm going to try and do, all right, brace yourselves, is uh, we're going to grab the first two. In fact, we're going to grab the first five and pull them forwards a little bit. I'll then stop. I will detach the first two. We'll then back up into the parallel siding and dump them. We'll grab the next three after that. And uh, and we'll go from there. Although that said... Hold on. No, not that one. I want this. Where does this lead to? If I come out the other way... No, that's totally unhelpful. Alright, okay. So, you're not going to be able to turn it around. So, I would say this way is uh, the more perilous. Unless you fancy driving it backwards the whole time. Well, it has to be. It's been a long time since I drove it backwards the entire time. So, uh, so yeah, I'm up for that. Uh, right, you are on the right side. Yes, the next one, however, isn't. Fine. Okay, stick it in reverse. Uh, break off. Give it just a little bit of juice. There we go. Right, let's chop down the track. Uh, see, my, this is my new method, you see. Because it takes a, a, a second or two for the train to get up to speed, I trot out ahead, go change the uh, points there. And then the next one, we don't want to go down that one either. That's it. And then we want to go down the third set. Do we? Yep, you do. Yep, this is the one. Yep, this is the one you want. Totally want this one. Right, and then you just wait for the train to turn up piece of cake really uh actually we'll we'll jump on board because i'm not taking any chances uh the number of times that i have ruined uh perfectly viable missions uh by wrecking it at the last minute or not doing it completely right or stuff like that and then you you end up spending an hour before going no you you've hosed it son that's uh, that's that's not working um i could i could count them on one hand now, admittedly, I can count the number of missions I've tried on one hand as well. I've really, really complete. I should probably be breaking. Oh, well, whatever. That's near enough. Uh, right. Uh, connect. Right. We only, we only want five of these. Two, three, four, five. Yes. Right. Detach the rest. Good. Right. Bang it in first. It's not first. It's forwards. But it amounts to the same thing. Uh, and then let's uh, let's roll it forwards a little. Now I'm going to trot up to the end here, uh, just to make sure that I've got the right ones. I'm pretty certain I have, but I do this every time, and you can guarantee the the, the first time I don't do this. Where are we? 41 is there. 42, 43. Right, we've got our uh, we've got our, our passengers for today. Uh, let's get on board again. 
Uh, now, you can, I mean, you can jump to get on the train, which is very exciting when you end up just jumping against the edge the entire time and not actually making any progress. Uh, slam yourself straight into the instrumentation there. Uh, it's the best way to let it know that you're in charge. Um, okay, right, so what we're going to do is we're going to back it up the way we've come. This sounds like a completely wretched idea. Uh, once I've got this this moving down the right side of the track, I'll, uh, I'll give you the, the full insight into the, uh, the mind of madness uh, that is leading us off this way. So we want to go down here. So it's that signal I need to change, and then we're all good. Okie doke, no problem. So we just check that the last car has cleared, which it hasn't. Still hasn't. Come around the corner, and uh, and then we'll stop up and uh, and change the signal accordingly. Now we're probably going to want to jump out to do that. There we go. That'll do. Right. Off. On. Reverse. Yeah, I know. Sticking it in reverse while you're still moving is not a great idea, uh, but I do it anyway. Uh, right. Now then, it's you there. You. Can I get a? Yep, yeah, I can. There you go. Perfect. All right. Give it a whiz. <clears throat> right, we're off and rolling. Uh, now, this is going to take a little while to go, especially since I'm pushing rather than pulling. Uh, that's less than ideal. I think what the uh, the intention was, uh, was that I... What happened to uh, to dropping off the first two? Oh, no, we'll take all of them. No, no, we'll take all five. It's fine. Um, uh, I'll make, a, I'll make a, a switch at some point. I tell you what, no, actually, no, we'll do it now, because this is going to save us hassle later on. If we now do this, come here, that's it, alright, now, ditch the last three, right, back in the forwards, no, 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 get the right handle in your hand and then wang it that way, shut that down, give it some of this, there you go, and then we'll just go and, we'll just go and throw these up a junction somewhere and we'll be good, uh, right, same one I reckon, where are you going? I don't really know. Uh, yep, yeah, nope, you're there. Bang that on. Pull this out. Change that. Yeah, go on. Go on. No. Nope. Actually, change it. That helps. All right, good. This is what shunting's all about, people. Is uh, the endless toing and froming up and down a little bit of track uh, just to make it comply with what you want to accomplish. Yeah, this is, this is going to work like no problem. used before. Didn't really end well, but I've done it anyway. Detach that. Put the brakes on. Oh, of course, yeah, because we're... <laughs> yeah, all right, what well, I should fail to... What I, what I omitted in the first episode of this was to point out that this old chap here is... this. That's the train brake, right? So uh, so wherever you... Uh, uh, when you let go of your, your coaches, your wagons, uh, they do not keep rolling. Which is a shame, because that's kind of what I'd hoped to accomplish there. But uh, but that's okay, we're almost in position. And that'll do it. Uh, right, enough. Thank you. You're already off, which is not what we want. We want on. Right, detach that lot. Change direction. And uh, away we go. Got rid of that lot. And hopefully we won't have had any phantom wagons turn up there in the, sh in the, uh, in the meantime. Right, okay, good. Progress is a word, and uh, it's a word that is undoubtedly suited to what we're doing here. You just have to be a little bit careful about not becoming complacent. I know, you, you don't assume that I'm ever going to become complacent, but believe me, it happens. Uh, right, okay, do that. Change the signal again. Right, back it up. Yeah, give me that. Do something. That you're already in the right... No, what? Yeah, no, no, you got that right. How did I get that right? I was just travelling the other way. Did I did I whack it into the right gear when I stopped? Oh, well, whatever. Uh, Okie dokie. Now, don't want to go too fast here, because uh, taking them off the rails is not not completely ideal. How much space have we got? That's it. Bit of brake. Bit more brake. Bit more brake. Near enough. Hook them up. Let's rock. Uh, you're off. You're off. Let's go. Are we good? Yes. Okay, right. Here's the plan. So, uh, no, here's the... Make... That was almost clever. Here's the plan. 
Right, okay, so we're going to back it up out the mountainside. Look for the uh, the little cyan dot thing there. Uh, right, so we're going to back it up around this, uh, this mountainous region uh, until we get to that junction that is just above uh, oil well north. I'll tell you what, I'll put some annotations on the screen now, help. Uh, till we get to the junction just outside Orwell North, um, and then we'll go too far. Uh, so we'll back over the junction and then we'll come back forwards. Uh, and then we're going to swing round Orwell North and head towards Goods Factory and Town. And I'm possibly going a little bit quicker than is ideal, uh, so let's ease it off there for a bit. Uh, now, as we exit town, it is a uh, it, it is a downward slope on the way in, so it's going to be an upward slope on the way out. That all, that all stands to region. That stands to region. Okay, if you say so. Uh, but yes, yeah, standing to region is what it does, and uh, we're just going to have to be a little bit careful. Now, unloaded these wagons aren't too bad, he said, uh, knowing full well that the game wants to trip you up at every opportunity. Um, but uh, once you've got a load on, they do get a bit tippy. Uh, that said, as I'm sure you noticed, I actually I, I wrecked a train on the way uh, on the way here. So, uh, you know, just uh, just go easy. Uh, right now, then, uh, with the latest update, apparently things have become a little bit less temperamental. I don't believe that. Oh, I should have should have hooted. There you go. Have some hooter. Um, yeah, apparently things have become less temperamental with today's update. <laughs> no, I don't trust that in the slightest. Uh, temperamentality is kind of what I'm expecting. Um, right, okay, now then, I'm not going to make you sit through all of this. Uh, although we do have a very pleasant bridge coming up, so I'll make you sit through that. Because, you know, I can start saying, oh, look at that lake, isn't it lovely? Uh, and uh, and you'll, you'll possibly agree. Um, anyway, look, here's the bridge to kind of deal kind of thing with the view. And, uh, and it's it's going to happen, okay? All right, so we'll, we'll do that, and then I'll skip some. All right, so, uh, so brace yourself. Ready? You know exactly what I'm going to say. So, ooh, there's the lake. Isn't it lovely? There you are. Right, aren't you glad you stuck around for that? Right, let's, uh, let's get a show on the road properly. Okay, we've made it this far without too much of an incident. Uh, the bridge that we were on before is just over there somewhere. Uh, but we've uh, we've winded our way around the corner, and we're coming up on the junction uh, that I'm going to want to adjust. And the question is, which way is it sending us to begin with? I think, although I could be wrong, uh, I think it's going to send us uh, the way I want to go, given that I came through here on me. Uh, there we go. Yep, absolutely. This is sending us the right way. It's going to... Uh, the left-hand path is where it's going to take us, which is what we want. We want to be going down there. Uh, but we're going to uh, we're going to overshoot this junction, and uh, and then uh, and then come back at it the other way because this is a it's a, a Y kind of a junction, uh, as you can see. So it goes up the other way as well, uh, and then we can go forwards, uh, which is charming. Um, well, it's, it, it's the ideal to be honest, um, but not many stations actually have the ability to do a, a, a proper turnaround. Uh, so you'd want to do. I mean, you could argue uh, rightly. Uh, that, uh, that had I attached to the other end of this uh, this consist and then done the stripping action that I did uh, previously, that uh, I'd have saved myself this bother. But actually, we've got it done, and it's it's actually no more of a hassle uh, than doing it the other way. Right, where's that signal? There it is. Okay. There you go. Wang the brakes on. Stick it in first. Get me junction remote. All right. Switch that over. Perfect. Right. All right. We're rolling again. See? Look how effortless. Easy peasy that was. Not, a, not the slightest problem in the entire universe. Uh, and, uh, and we're now on our way. So if we, uh, if we pull up the map, here we go. Uh, you'll see that we now head down uh, along this curve here. And then uh, that's just a, just a bit more progress. Um, oh, look at that lake. That's ah, lovely. Maybe be going just a little fast. Now, if you hear... Hold on. If I go outside, you might hear it better. Right. You hear that very, very faint whistling sound. No, it's not even a whistling sound. Uh, let's... Uh, what's the best way to do it? I'll tell you what the best way to do it is. We'll take that off. We'll do this. Right? Now, this is the, the wheel slip sound that you get. Right? And... There. Right. Take that off. 
And then if we give it, like, you know, way too much, listen, wheel slip. Right? Okay, pretty classic wheel slip sound there. Uh, now, if you start to hear that while you're not wheel slipping, uh, and instead you're going around a corner, um, it will start off, it's, it's, it's very nicely done. Um, it starts off really quite faint, but the more of that that you hear, uh, the more you are pushing it as you go around the corner. So if you start to hear it, the ideal is that you uh, you start to slow down a bit. It's basically when you start getting some metal on metal ground uh, grinding going on. That would be a good way to describe it, really. Um, yeah, not whistling at all. Metal on metal grindage. You hear that, it means you're pushing it. Um, I, I'm sure it will crop up at some point. And look at this. Ah, lake, isn't it? Isn't it lovely? Oh. I feel I, this is just jolly atmospheric, um, is, is what it is, totally. Okay, right, let's, uh, let's not hang around, we don't want to be here all day. Uh, I'll advance us to the next stage that is exciting. Brace yourselves. There you go, hear it? Just ever so gently means that I'm on the edge there a bit, uh, so we'll apply a bit of brake and then we'll take it back off again. I'm freewheeling at the moment. Because um, we've got a gentle downhill going, and it stops the engine overheating. Uh, I've not had that be a problem before, um, but uh, it's bound to happen at some point. So, there you go. See, look, still going a bit fast. I think we're probably all right. Uh, if we look at the map, you can usually get a read for when you've got a tight corner coming up. So this one might be... Actually, based on the length of it, should be okay. Um, but... Uh, I have I've derailed at every speed from kind of 15 to 30 uh, kilometers an hour. Uh, I have yet to derail a train going at 50. Um, but that's largely because when I've actually got wagons attached, I tend to play in a slightly more well-behaved fashion. Um, yeah. And obviously these are unloaded, and this, uh, this mission doesn't require me to load them up, so, uh, so you know, that's all going to be good. Uh, now, I know you've noticed, I, I, I realise you've, you've seen, you've got various bits of rock and tree uh, clipping through. Well, that was an exciting graphical moment there. Um, uh, clipping through the track on occasion. And uh, the dev team are, I am assured, uh, working on, uh, on removing all of those. Oh, hang on. I, I didn't look which way I was supposed to be going here. Stick that on. I'm pretty sure I just fly through, but I don't want to have to back up. Uh, yeah, we're going to we're going to the right, which is the way it's sending us. All right, fine. Good. It's better to stop and check than overshoot and then back up. And you can guarantee if you don't stop and check, you just went the wrong way um, every time, guaranteed. Because uh, that's how the universe works. Uh, uh, for those of you new to the universe, you may not have experienced this yet. Uh, but if you do check, you can guarantee you didn't need to. If you don't check going the wrong way. Uh, right, okay, so where are we going next? We're taking a, uh, a that way. Okay, alright. So next junction, which is coming up in uh, in no time at all. How are we going? Uh, let's get it up to about 40. Now I'm going to want to slow down for that junction, because uh, junctions are where things are at their most perilous. Because uh, you get some physics happen as you, uh, as you ride over the rails. Uh, yeah, it is going to be coming up pretty quick. How do we feel our uh, our speed changes are and we're going to walk through this tree? Right, okay, no, not that. Give me uh, this one. Now then, you also get, when you point your your signal hoofer doofer at the signal, it, it gives you an arrow, as you can see there. The arrow's pointing the wrong way. So once we switch that over, it points the right way. Now obviously, if you can, if you can read the signal and the diagonal line pointing over to the left is what we want, uh, then you're never going to have that uh, that requirement, um, but it is a, an extra piece of safekeeping. The only time you uh, you come in any difficulty with the, the signal uh, uh, hoofer doofer is uh, is when you um, uh, when you have multiple signals kind of queued up ahead of you. Is sometimes it's a bit tricky to target the one you want. Typically, you will need to go through the first signal before you can start messing with the second one. If there's two, right? So you will always, you'll it'll always try and give you the first, uh, the, the closest uh, signal to whatever it is that you're doing. Uh, right, let's uh, take it out of gear, and then we should pick up a bit of downhill speed here. 
we should pick up a bit of downhill speed. We're not still coming through the junction. We've done that. Downhill speed. I haven't got any brake applied. Am I just it inferring that this is a downhill section uh, because of the way that the bank is sloping? All right, okay, well, we'll, we'll give it some we'll give it some cheese then. Uh, right, how far are we? Uh, more or less a straight line from here. That should be no problem. Now, the nice thing about the goods factory is that it's got a loop on it, on it um, and that's very helpful because it means you can turn your train around, I think. Um, I've actually, I've never tried it. I'm, I'm just as happy going backwards as forwards. Arguably happier, um, but uh, that's not going to be that's not going to be a problem. Really? Is this not downhill? It it very much looks downhill. No, I guess it's just the way the banks are sloped. All right, fine. Uh, right, where are we heading to? Uh, we're going to. You know, we've done that. Uh, we're in the process of doing that, and then uh, S09. Okay, fine. Uh, station map. Thank you. Goods, 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 goods. Missed it. Goods. S09 is... Oh, it's around the far side. Uh, so where you see the SW there, uh, we're going to come in that way. Uh, then we're going to whiz it up the middle, go around the outside, and then it's all the way over hard left. Fine. Obviously, it's hard right as you look at it now, but it's hard left as we approach it, because we'll be facing in the other way. See? That's uh, it's the kind of attention to detail you need when you're a professional uh, shunteria, as I am. A shunteria is, uh, is a title for, for what I am. There, there is no one else who is one, of course, because I just made that up. This tunnel appears to have some kind of tumour growing on it. Uh, I'm sure that can be uh, surgically uh, rearranged at some point. There you go. It only, only took out a little bit of the cab. Uh, but here we are, arriving at the goods factory. Uh, they very generously left another train for me there, just in case I wreck this one. That's, uh, that's jolly sporting of them. Um, those containers, oh, they're not just for show. Uh, when, you're, when you're hauling in the opposite direction, you tend to, uh, those, that tends to be what you're hauling. Right, keep your pit eyes peeled for the office. We're doing a fly-through of this bit, because uh, we're going around the other side. Um, arguably, I'm going a bit quick for yard work, uh, but uh, but they don't call me Mr. Express Delivery uh, at all. They call me Mr. Prone to Making an Accident at the last minute. There you go. No, that's it. That's enough. Not too much. We, no, we don't need to come to a full stop. It's just because there's a bit of a kink in this bit of track, and I don't want to wreck it when we're uh, so close to glory. There you go. See? Look, kink. There you go, see, the lads come through there, and they're all happy. Ah, oh, right, now, what? Oh, oh, I've possibly left this a bit late. Give it just a bit of that. That's it. Right, is that enough to keep it moving? More or less. More or less? You reckon? Just a, just a smidge more. Right, here we go. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to belt it across here before the train makes it round the curve uh, to uh, to get the signals changed. Uh, I've done it before; it felt pretty good. Um, it's uh, it's all just a it's it's just a race against time. See, look, that, that's going to gradually pick up speed. Now I can teleport myself back on there anytime I please, um, but. Uh, I'm only intending to do that once I've got all the signals set. We'll check this first one, because I'm uncertain which way it's currently facing. In fact, I'm pretty sure it's facing the wrong way. Actually, totally sure it's facing... No, it's facing the right way. It's facing the right way. Okay, good. That's number one. Now, we're going over to the leftmost line here. Uh, so, uh, that's number two. And, uh, and then we want this one as well. That's it, and then the last one as well, uh, and that should be SO9. Where's the train? The train's fine. Um, yeah, I know. I'm adding some drama into what is quite a dry period in this uh, in this train drama that we have going on, and that should say SO9, which it does. Obviously, there's wagons in the way. We'll just push them out of the way. Um, and then, uh, then we can come back. That See, by doing it this way, you've got plenty of time to set the signals correctly. You know the train's not going to go too fast. And then you can uh, cloud you with a chance of boulders growthing on the side of the mountain there. Uh, 
Are these transport fever mountains? Yeah, they might well be. Right, let's grab back on here. Uh, right, so we're going to hook up to the, uh, the those loose flat cars that are stuck in there, and we're just going to shove them out of the way uh, until I've got my uh, my uh, my load in place, and uh, then we'll detach and uh, go get the money because that's the last thing we've got to do. Right, uncouple. Right, there is no page six. Good. Okay, fine. I'm on board. I've got this under control. I'm a total, total shunting professional. Uh, total, total shunting professional. Here we go. Right, now then. Here we are. Get ready on the brakes. About now, possibly apply a smidge. There you go. And that should uh, keep our rate of progress nice and gentle, like so. <laughs> See, you didn't expect that at all, did you? You expect me to go pile driving into them without any care and attention at all. Well, I'm afraid not. No, I am the shunting professional. They call me shunter driver because uh, that's what I'm doing. We're going to push this straight through the junction at the end, aren't we? Yeah, there's the station office. That's good to know. Right, how far have we got to go? Well, we're pretty much there. All right, turn that off. Stick that on. Go and uh, uh, let's detach the front lot. No, no, no. Sure? Yeah. Detach the back lot and then uh, keep pushing the front lot a little bit further. But you've already, they're already in the. You know, I mean, they're arguably, they're about safe right now. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Right, that's enough. Right, and uh, detach them as well. Nope. That's it. Yeah, right there. And, uh, and then I want to back up by about a foot and a half. Uh, just to say, I have nothing to do with any of these wagons whatsoever. I just Houdini'd my train in. That's not really a Houdini trick, that one. I just David Copperfielded my, uh, my loco in there. Right, turn it off. Let's go get paid. Right, doddle. There you go. See, so we've got a bit of a gap there. We've got a bit of a gap there. No direct association going on. There is no way this can suggest that I have not done the gig. Because I have done the gig. You saw me do it. You, validate this. Looks green. Give me my money. There we are. Four and a bit grand. Chuck it on the floor. I haven't found a better way to do this yet. I tried picking it up with my wallet hand previously. Didn't work. Take the money. 18,000. Right, so that's a shunting job that will get us over the line. Although, to be honest, what I think I'll probably do is take something that goes a little bit further. Uh, we'll take some goods that are already done, and uh, and well, that will get us over the edge. And then we can go buy it. Yeah, near enough. Uh, and then we can buy ourselves a, uh, a steam train, which will be a modern, uh, a modern wonderment and delight. I've been Colonel Failure. Thank you very much for tuning in today. Uh, stay tuned for further adventures in Derail Valley. Uh, for there will be adventures, and you'll be invited. Subscribe if you've not already done so, because that would make you splendid, and fling a like at this one if you enjoyed it. I'll be back very soon with the same, only different. Cheerio! So a little closer to my goal of uh, getting that steam train on the go, and, uh, and I'll probably hit that next time round. Uh, in fact, I'll be ready next time round. How about that? I won't keep you waiting any longer. We'll get the steam train. Uh, not so much on the derailing so far, although we did come off the rails there once, but you, we will just ignore that. Um, it's quite a lot of fun. Uh, it's satisfying because you've got something to chase after. Uh, uh, whether I managed to, uh, to maintain my level of enthusiasm after stacking a steam train only to find I can't get another one, who knows? Uh, so you're going to have to stick around in order to find out. Uh, anyway, subscribe to do that. That's, that's a thing to do. Yes.